are back in the Movement by MK studio, you guys, and I am so excited to sweat with you as always. Today we have a full body burner. It's gonna be a tri-set followed by a seven minute AMRAP, so probably around like 20 to 25 minutes. We'll see how long it takes us. We're gonna stretch it out, crush the workout together, and then we'll cool it down. So you need water, you need weights around five to 30 pounds, and you need good energy. We are gonna set the tone for our day together and I can't wait. So let's kick it off, you guys. Are you ready? Are you excited? All right, cool. Bring those arms out to the side. I just want you to roll out your shoulders here. You're gonna need your cell phone too because we're gonna have to time ourselves for that AMRAP. Good, loosen it up, take a second, roll out your neck side to side. Good, really setting into your space here. Bring your arms on up center. You're gonna drop this arm down behind your back, stretch out those shoulders, biceps, triceps, everything in between. <laughs> Start swinging it out here, switch it on out. You guys are gonna love today, I already can tell. It is so good. Oh, you are gonna be drenched in sweat, you're gonna feel amazing. And that's the point, right? Bring it behind you here, give me that deep stretch with those shoulders, take a big deep breath in through the nose. Exhale through the mouth as you bring it on down into this big forward fold. It just never fails. Like I always need to loosen up my shoulders. Good, release your hands on down. Take a second here, roll out that neck and then I want you to roll it up one vertebrae at a time. I want you to kind of kick it back right here as you release those shoulders together and push forward. Again, just loosening up that upper body. Good, don't worry, we'll get in a cardio blast before we start <laughs> the tricep. I'll loosen you up as always. Maybe those steps get a little bit bigger, those pushes get a little bit stronger. Good, we're here for six. Squeeze together, it's four, for three, for two, and one, we're gonna step it out to the side. Good, warming us up for that full body blast. To the side here, just little taps. You're gonna get a little bit bigger. You're starting to get loosened up. We're gonna go right into front runs. In three, in two, and one. You're gonna come right here, one foot in front of the other. So your shoulders should be loosened up. Your hips should be nice and stretched out. You warmed up that back just a little bit. Now we're warming up those legs, getting that heart rate up, and we'll jump right into it. So we're gonna have a tricep, which is Reverse lunge with a lateral raise, a burpee snatch combo, and a deadlift into a deep center squat. So three moves, three times through. I want you guys to drop it down in three, in two, in one. Hold it here, side to side. Little lunges here, just loosening up your thighs and legs. We go back into that front run, in four, in three, in two, and one, front run it out, let's go. One foot in front of the other, good work. All right, we're here, it's eight for seven. Grabbing dumbbells around five, eight, 10, 12. In four, three, two, and one. So these are always hard for me, I'm gonna start out with tens. Okay, so we got three times through. I'm gonna start my timer here. And then we'll get rocking. I'm gonna start out with 10. You're gonna bring it back into reverse. Lateral raise here. Back into reverse, lateral raise. 45 seconds, we are on. Then we come in to the burpee snatch combo. Don't worry, I'm gonna demo for you and we're gonna do it together. Oh yeah, now you're wondering why we warmed up those shoulders <laughs> and those booties and legs. Full body combo here. You got about 20 seconds left and I need you to grab something a little bit heavier. So 12, 15, 20, if you have it. And we're gonna come in to the snatch combo. Now if you have weaker shoulders, we're gonna do something else and I'll demo for you. We got five more here for four, for three, for two, and one. So drop that weight 
grab something a little bit heavier. I'm gonna go with 20s. And you're gonna bring that dumbbell in between your legs. Bring it up for one. Bring it up for two. Drop dumbbell here. Kick it back for one and two burpees. We are on, let's hit it. If you have a bad shoulder, dumbbell is here. We just row up, dumbbell drops down. We row up, we drop it back, we burpee it out. If you need to modify the burpee, you're just gonna walk it back into that plank and walk it on up. Good, it's one, shoulders are open. It's two, drop it back, we're on. Quick last, but trust me, we're gonna do it three times. You're gonna be like, oh my goodness. Whew. 10 more seconds. We come into that heavy deadlift. So get in your final reps here. It's five for four. Kick it back wherever you're at for three, for two, and one. Now for this heavy deadlift, one dumbbell here, hip shift back, bring it up, drop booty down, dumbbell comes center, bring it up, shift hips back, shoulders roll back, drop it down, we're on. Whew. This is a doozy. Good work, 45 seconds. Then we have two more rounds. We'll get a sip of water and we'll go into our seven minute AMRAP. I want you to focus, hip shift back, then you drop on down, you bring it up, booty and hips come back, good, come on up, drop it down. <sighs> Breathing here. We got it, it's eight. First seven, starting from the top. In six, five, we reverse lunge, lateral raise in four, in three, two, and one. <laughs> Let's go, you guys. Grab those weights, 45 seconds. Kick it back. This is gonna be a full body blast. <laughs> You're gonna leave here being like, wow, I think I just worked every muscle that I had. You did, 30 seconds, okay? Then we come back. Snatch, double burpee combo. If not, it's that upright row into the double burpee. If not, it's that plank walk up. Hit an air squat. 12 seconds. Form is on point. For five, for four, second time through, for three, for two, and one. Heavy weight coming back in. Dumbbell comes center. We hit it up for one. Swing it up for two. Keeping dumbbell close to body. Kick it back. One and two. You got about 30 seconds left. The clock goes so fast, you guys. 15 seconds left. Giving it all you got here but still focusing on your form, which is most important. Good, we're here for five, for four, for three, for two, and one. Grabbing that heavy weight. Shifting back, shifting down. I'm so sweaty. Out of breath, with heavy weights, Minimal jumping except the burpee. Good. 20 seconds here. And then you got one more round. So think about it. How do you feel on your third round versus your first? Just like probably how you felt first workout versus like your fifth with me, right? We got it for three, for two, and one, lighter weights on deck. 45 seconds going down in three, two, and one. Shift back, out to the side. Focusing on form, shoulders rolled back, 
Nice lunge, bringing those dumbbells to the side, not squeezing up at your neck too much, letting that core take control here. Good, out to the side. 30 seconds. I love this workout. <laughs> Woo, hopefully you do too. We haven't even gotten to the best part, the MRAP. That one's fun. 10 seconds. We go into your third and final round. Burpee snatches in three, in two, in one. I want you to crush this round. But remember, dumbbells close to the body. We swing it up for one. We swing it up for two. Drop it on down. We kick it back. Good, booty's coming down, chest is open, dumbbell snatch, double burpee. 30 seconds. Never seeing this again today. If you have to row it out, just like that, nice and controlled, that's fine too. And if you have to walk it back and walk it up, that works just as well. 10 seconds, so keep pushing wherever you're at. It's five, for four, for three, for two, and one. Grab a quick sip. I'm gonna get my timer ready. Woo. Seven minute AMRAP, going down. I'm gonna demo, then we'll get that timer started. So, you got dumbbell swings, Dumbbell is center, hips are shoulder width apart, booty comes back. We're not squatting here. Hips come back, bring it forward. If you don't have the weight, then you are squatting. Halo swing, okay? Coming in to 15, I can't believe I did this to you. <laughs> 90 degrees, so it's one, two, and then you count on. Or 15 air squats. 12 goblet squats, toes are pointed out, drop it down, 15 plank jacks, okay? We're on, in three, two, and one. Timer is going, you are at your own pace here. You're getting in as many rounds of these four moves as you can in seven minutes. Working everything here, glutes, core, shoulders. Good, remember, we're not doing a squat. Hips are shifted back. Once you hit your 12, 15 90s or 15 air squats. It's one, two, three, you got it down. Taking breaks when you need it. Breaking these up if you have to. I got five more. Coming into those 12 goblets. Six minutes on the clock. Toes are pointed out. Going heavy around here, 10, 12, 15, 20, 25, 30. Ooh, <laughs> these are so hard. It's okay to take it slow. I'm halfway. because I want you guys to do them accurately and I want you to focus on increasing your weight here. Oh boy, I got 11 and 12. And those pretty plank jacks. If you need a modification, tabletop, tap it out. If you're with me, hands directly on your shoulders, gaze is down, in and out, 15 total. there coming into round two you might be ahead or behind that's okay we're on our same we're on our own path right four minutes 45 seconds left what matters 
is that you're pushing yourself with every move and round. There might be a slight bend in the knees here, but not that total squat. Good. I don't know what's the hardest part, probably the 90s. So 15, or air squats. All right, let's go, pep talk time. <laughs> Come on. Speed it up a bit if you can. Push through. It is uncomfortable. You gotta keep going. 13, 14, 15, power goblets. Three minutes, 45 seconds left. Adjust yourself if needed. Grab a sip if you need it. Okay, drop it down. Bring it up. Going as fast or as slow as you need to. Breathing. Not bouncing at the top. Slow and steady. Squeeze. I got two more. Final one. Dropping dumbbell down. Coming into those plank jacks. Two minutes, 45 seconds. We are getting so close, you guys. Position yourself here. 15 seconds all out. For 15 plank jacks. All out. Probably takes you 15 seconds. Whew. Back in round three. Two and a half minutes left. I'm hair flipping a lot today. All right. It keeps me going. You guys keep me going. That's seven for me. You gotta fight through. Push to the end. That's 12. Hardest part. Round three, 90 degrees. One minute, 45 seconds left. Let's hit it. Best part is it's only seven minutes. 12, 13, 14, 15, one minute, 30 seconds. So, so close. You gotta keep going. Come on. I'm doing it, you're doing it too. I'd be lying to you if I said I wasn't struggling right now. Physically tired. Mentally, like, okay, I'm hanging in there, I can do it. Every day, you are not gonna feel 100%, but you can choose how you wanna think. Positive mindset or negative. Victimizing yourself or helping yourself change and evolve. I got four more. That's three, for two, Woo. final one, 30 seconds left. You're deciding where you're finishing today. How many more moves can you get in? 30 seconds, all out. <laughs> 15 seconds on the clock. What round are you finishing on today? One, two, three, three and a half, four. I'm starting my fourth. Eight seconds. First six. Five. Alarm's going off in four. Three. Two. And one. Woo! Seven minute AMRAP. Done and dusted. Tricep. And 
in AMRAP, done and dusted. Let's cool it down, you guys. Walk it on out. Take a sec. Whew. Good. Grab on to your wall, chair, dresser, couch. Bend to the gym wherever you're at. Stretch out these quads. Starting with the left foot. Hold it here. That was a doozy. Release it down. Switch out those sides. Oh yeah, stretch out that right quad. Give yourself a nice little squeeze here. Good. Release it down. We're just gonna shift our hips back and bring it up. Shift hips back, bring it up. This hair has a mind of its own today. Yep, stretching out low back, stretching out hamstrings here. Chest is towards the mat. Hips are nice and squared off, just shifting back. Good, we walk it out into a plank. In three, two, and one, come on back. Good. Come into tabletop here. I love stretching out these arms, so pass on through right here and hang out for just a sec. Maybe you're closing your eyes, still catching your breath. Whatever it is, wherever you're at in your space, stay there. Bringing it back up into tabletop, switching those arms out. Again, closing your eyes. Feeling your heart race through your chest and slowly coming back down. Bringing it up center, bringing feet wide, dropping hips back, rolling it out here, extending arms long, coming into that child's pose. I will stay lifted here, but I want you to rest your forehead down on the mat. Thinking about how far you've come, not only just today, but each and every day you walk into this room. You make the decision to turn on your phone, your computer, to put on your clothes, to get dressed, and you schedule this time into your day. You're making that choice. That is a choice that not everybody makes. And because you're making it, I promise, it is going to unfold for you. All the positive energy you're seeking, that self-confidence, that self-empowerment, that time to decompress, that time to just release, it's right here in this room every single day you sign on. Don't forget about that. Don't lose sight of the big picture, of the big goal, because every small step you take is gonna get you a little bit closer there. And it all starts with you showing up. Be proud of yourself, recognize your hard work, give yourself the credit where it's due, and can continue to push yourself to be a better woman than you were yesterday, mentally, emotionally, and physically. Close your eyes as we finish our time here together. Say out loud or to yourself one thing you are grateful for today. Hold on to that, remember that, and always come back to this moment anytime you're filled with anxiety, self-doubt, stress. Know that this space is always waiting for you. Bring yourself on up, you guys. Release your booties on back. Hold it here. <sighs> Take that big deep breath out. Walk it on up. Hold your hands here for just a moment and roll yourself up one word way at a time. Close your eyes. One more moment to yourself. One more big deep breath in and exhale. Good work. You guys just crushed that. <laughs> Tricep, seven minute AMRAP. It was a doozy. You can always do the tricep again. 
And you can always do the MRAP two times through or three times if you're that motivated <laughs> to make it a little bit longer if you want. But regardless, you got in a super quick, effective workout in a short amount of time. And I hope you feel amazing. And I'll see you next time. Thank you so much. Have a good day.